Hey guys, it's Mako One here for a brand new vlog. Um, so yeah, um, I'm on my new laptop. Um, so I've just put it in my room, set it all up. Um, it's all working. Um, moved my condenser mic in here. Just moved a shitload of stuff out of my room. Um, like an old desktop, not the one I was using whilst I got a laptop, but um, a really old one that was just in there from when I tried to see if it still worked. Um, and it didn't. So yeah. Um so I'm feeling pretty good, pretty comfortable. Um I've been able to you may notice that I am in uh custom I'm in like slightly high definition I'm on the direct it looks a bit better than lowest. Um but I'm not really on HD just because the laptop can do it but I don't want to do it for videoing. Um because I don't need to change this screen size and it's just a bit annoying it's too zoomed out but um, yeah it's really good because I don't like it's got like um, I told you all the specs of the laptop so it's a really good gaming laptop so I am really happy and it's also something I can take to school because I start sixth form in about three weeks so yeah I'm gonna be studying um, I've taken sociology psychology um, business and uh, business and economics and uh, government and politics so you know pretty interesting stuff some would say you know it's gonna be really hard but I think it's you know I think it's gonna be fun Um it doesn't matter how hard the subject is really if you find it interesting you'll do well and I find it very interesting Um you know that's kinda why I was interested when I first heard about the old like the game and the rules of the game um, those two books and that's kind of why I've gotten into that um, some brief updates on my character um, I got like 20k XP in attack so only 80k off not too not too far to go now until 94 um, as I said though blue uh, green dragons are pretty shit XP let's be honest they're pretty shit um, so that w that'll still take a while 49k t XP till 97 um, as I said um, I might consider maybe from 98 to 99 doing Soul Wars, but to be honest, it's not something I really want to do. I'm not going to be doing it now anyway, because let's be honest, Soul Wars is absolutely just awful. It's just boring, it's uh, frustrating when you don't get in a game, and just all those kind of things. It just pisses me off. So, um, so yeah, but... Yay, we're up to 17.2 mil. 17.2 mil. Um, BCP right now is like 21 mil for lowest, 22 mil for medium. It's not, you know, it's not too far off. Um, I'll definitely get that before the end of the holidays. So that, you know, that'd be pretty good. Um, what am I worth at the moment? 83 mil. I've gone down by 1 mil. Because of probably items dropped because I've made money today, um, but yeah. Um, so other than that, uh, what is new with me? Well, what did I do? Oh yeah, yesterday. Um, I didn't make a video because I was really busy. Um, it was a really good day though. I went to a small, like little village. Like I don't even know if you Americans like have towns that small, like a village. Um like really old English village you know with little like Victorian houses um, and tiny little shops like little cozy shops it's a really beautiful place actually uh, like out in the countryside like it, it is really probably like a typical stereotype of an English village if you can picture that in your head in the countryside and it was really really beautiful um, so I really did enjoy that day out um, Actually, I'm a bit pissed off because I'm making my video now, but I've only just realised that um, I show Ricky Gervais. What's it called? I'll just click more info here on my TV. Um, what's it called? Oh, it's just called the Ricky Gervais Show. Um, he's a comedian, English comedian, uh, and you Americans might know him because he's been in some films. Uh, what films has he been in? The one about lying, the invention of lying, and some other ones. Um, but yeah, and it's just like a cartoon with him and a guy called um, Carl Pilkington. And I forget the other guy's name, but oh my god, it's hilarious. It's just them really sat talking 
in cartoon form. But they just the conversations they have are just hilarious, and Ricky Gervais's laugh just oh god, it goes through me. It's just it's hilarious. Um, and for people that don't know what I'm talking about, check it out or um, or just ignore that bit. That bit doesn't apply to you. And um, we'll move swiftly on. Um, so yeah, I went out to that place. Um, it's called Bakewell. Um, went there. It was really beautiful. Um, it was really summer's day, like really nice, beautiful summer's day as well, which which made the day so much better. You know, um, in, in England, it's pretty shit weather in summer. I'll be honest, it it really is. But um, that was really really good weather that day, so that was a success. What else did I do? Um, oh yeah, today, today I went to um, like the local shopping centre, like shopping mall. Um, and it's got, you know, like a cinema in it and all those kind of things. So, I went with my friends, um, went there, watched the new film, The Karate Kid, with Jackie Chan in it and that Will Smith's son. Uh, it, w- it was a pretty good film. Um, yeah, it was a good film, but, uh, yeah, it was just a bit average. There was nothing really about it. It, it was it was kind of like a remake of the old ones, but not because he didn't really follow a strict storyline to the old ones. It, it en- they'd enhanced it a bit, which I suppose they've got to do for you know like modern day uh, times. But yeah, I, I didn't mind Mr. Uh, Jackie Chan as like a Mr. Miyagi type of character. I think he played it really well, uh, and I re- I really do um, I really like Jackie Chan because he's like 50 now and he's still doing his own stunts. You know, and he doesn't even, if he does it in China, he doesn't even get uh, any compensation if he hurts himself because they don't really have compensation in China. It's not like in the US or in England. If you, like, fall over at work, you can sue work. Or if you fall over in a pothole, you know, you can, there's a lot, a lot of the time you can compen- get compensation. And in China, it's just not that way. So, um, I do respect him for that. And, uh, yeah, obviously, Will Smith's son had done a lot of working out for that film. He's only like young. He's not like he wasn't like buff, but you could tell he had like a pack going, and uh, he he basically could get his leg up to like his head, which you know that's impressive. Um, I found that pretty impressive. Um, what other stuff? Oh yeah, d- today was day four. I-, I wanted to finish off day four properly. Um, of the of the game, the rules to the game by Neil Strauss, and so I had to approach some girls and um, get a recommendation on a good shopping like just a men's clothing shop so um, I wanted to do that again just with just just really to get over the fear of it a bit again so you know I did that I was sat I was sat eating KFC um, in the like oasis bit where you get all the food and so I'm sat down and then there's this girl that, that I've seen and she was absolutely fine but she had a like a kid with her um, and then the girl, I thought, I thought she's about my age, you know, 16, 17. And there was a kid there, and I'm like, surely to God, that, that has got to be her sister. Because, you know, if it's not, like, that would make her, like, what, 12 when she had the kid or some bullshit. So I was like, Jesus Christ, please let her be her sister. And then I heard it was when she started saying, I opened her, and I was like, you know, um, asked for a recommendation. And, you know, it went really well. I, <laughs> I mean, I'll not lie, I felt, like, literally sick before I asked. I was like, I was like, oh, I'm, I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. And I was like, oh no, I don't want to say, I don't want to say, I've gone blank. And I was like, no, no, no I'm going to do it. So I ended up counting down from 10 to 1 <laughs> backwards just to get rid of nerves because I heard that helped. And it did, you know, and it went it went really well. And after that, she was really nice and I was like, I just felt on top of the world, you know. It, it just made such a big difference because it's something I'd never usually do. would just see a really attractive girl and think, you know, I, I'm going to go up to talk to her. But, you know, you see, guys should try that, just walking down your streets. If you see, like, the most attractive girl, just pretend. Just pretend that you're not from that city and just ask, you know, what's the worst that can happen? Um, so, day five tomorrow, <laughs> so you'll get to see what stupid stuff I have to do then, and I'll report that back. Oh, Cleveland Brown show's on tonight. Um, so, yeah, I'm definitely going to watch that. So, I'm going to get off here and watch that, like, now. So, you know, I just want to write in the comments, what have you been up to recently? How's your holidays going? Or how's it going if you're back to school already? Hopefully not. So, yeah, comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks to all my subscribers. I've got 31 of you guys now. So, you know, congratulations to you to subscribing to me. Congratulations to me as well. (laughs) Thanks for watching, guys. See you in a bit.